Hi and welcome to my The Foreigner trailer review and reaction. So the so the Foreigner is a movie that's coming out on October 13, 2017, directed uh, by Martin Campbell, star Jackie Chan and Pim Brompton, and a budget is 35 million box office. We don't know yet. Until the movie come out on October 13, 2017, we don't know if it will be a big, big off, big box office a dead or big box office flop. Okay, we don't know until it come out yet. And if we leak that in October 13, 2017, and in the trailer, it said the director of Captain uh, Royale, Captain Royale, Martin Campbell, the director of uh, the movie that come out on October 13, 2017, The Foreigner. With uh, Jackie Chan and Pim Bronson. And he, uh, Martin Campbell directed Catherine Royale. He also directed, uh, they might be my favorite in Bob Marie, uh, uh, GoldenEye. I love GoldenEye. Good action thing in it. Beautiful women. Uh, a good Jane Bond actor. Love that movie. Grew up watching that movie. Love it. I can watch it a hundred times and never get tired of it. Okay? And if I had to pick between one of the two, uh, what's my favorite Martin Campbell Game Bomb movie? I would pick on I love Go uh, Golden Eye, okay? And this is my this is his best Game Bomb movie. Uh, that uh, that Pim Bronson did, and he's gonna be as uh, the foreigner. But uh, the foreigner is probably more of a Jackie Chan movie than Pim Bronson, okay? Now, the only reason I want to go see the only reason I want to go see the foreigner is because it has Pim Bronson in it, and and I'm gonna tell y'all that Pim Bond is one of my favorite actors of all time. He's in my top ten favorite. Okay? Now he I put him up there with uh Clay Troy, John Wayne, Tom Hank, Arnold Fortunator. Yeah, some of those guys that I like of all time. If I had to rank some of my favorite actors of all time, he would be up there. Pim Bond would be up there with Arnold Fortunator, Tom Hank, Clay Troy, John Wayne. Yeah, those are some of those are some of my actors I like. Of all time, and Pim Bronson would be in. I'm a big Pim Bronson fan, and you you know some of the other actors I like, P uh, uh, Tom Hanks, John Wayne, all the fortune and stuff. But Pim Bronson, I'm a big Pim Bronson fan. That's why I'm through. I, I want to see that movie, but I really see more of Pim Bronson movie that he's the main star, instead of being a co-star. But I'm still a big Pim Bronson fan, and that's why I have a lot of Pim Bronson movie. Like I have big movie. Denton Peak. Um, after the Sunset, Atomic Crown Affair. I love that movie. Then I have a mini theory called Noble and How. A lot of people have never heard of it. And I, I have this one uh, Law of Attraction. Mary Live. Another Pim Bronson movie. It had Crick Cooper and Rachel McAdams. Oh, love, love Ma Rachel McAdams. She's beautiful. And I can't wait. Uh, and also Mamma Mia. Can't wait next year for Mamma Mia too. We'll go see that movie next year. Because of Pim Bronson. Uh, the Love Punch. And these are probably some of his best movies that he did solo. Uh, uh, Pim Bronson. The, the, the November Man. Uh, Survivor and No Escape by Open Wilson. Okay? Now, we know who Jackie Chan is from Rush Hour. Love Rush Hour. Jackie Chan, love Rush Hour. Who doesn't like Jackie Chan? Okay? And I'm going to see that movie. And, and be honest, I'm going to be honest. I'll be honest with you. It'll be frank with you, be honest. Whatever you want to call it. If it didn't have people out there in it, if it did not have people on there, I'll probably not go see it. Sorry, Jackie Chan. But, Pim Bronson, the only reason I'm going to get Jackie, uh, get, get in the theater to go see that movie with you in it, Jackie Chan. Just that, because I'm going to be a Pim Bronson fan. Now, I love you, you, Jackie Chan, and Rush Hour. I love that movie. They're a classic. Okay? You do have some good movies, Jackie Chan, like that, Rush Hour. Now, now, this, this look like it'd be a good movie. I'm going to say, Martin Campbell, 
You're a good director. You directed, you, you directed some of the good Game Boy movies of all time. One of my favorites. Uh, Go, GoldenEye. And this movie, some people say it might be like another Taken movie. No, don't don't go there. Don't go there. Don't go there. We, we, we don't need no uh, Taken franchise, trilogy, sequel, or whatever. Let there be another uh, the one movie back there. That's it. And, and, and that's it. No stick or anything, okay? And that'd be a good, okay, action movie. Make some good movie at the box office, no flop. And good popcorn movie. Good story, all that stuff. And that's it, okay? And now, in the, in, in the trailer, I always talk about, it's just about Martin Campbell. Now let's talk about, if Pip Bond's a bad guy, or he's just some, somebody that we don't know yet in the trailer. Because in the trailer, he fought Jackie Chan in the trailer. Is he bad or he good? I don't know, cause he won't tell Jackie Chan who, uh, uh who the terrorist is, and he Pim Blonte is a terrorist, cause there been some um, previous uh, Pim Blonte movie where he was the bad guy, and he playing another bad guy in this movie again, cause like, like, like some of the other movies I have on DVD of Pim Blonte, he was a bad guy. Is he playing a bad guy in this movie again? I don't know, and hopefully I'm not. I don't like him when Prim Bond is a bad guy. I like him when he's good, when he's good, funny, something like that. Now, now, the, 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 some of him movies when he was bad, he was good. He did a good performance. Okay? Now, I, I'm going to see that movie. And hopefully they're good at the bottom of it, don't flop. Probably not going to be, not going not to make like, you know, four or five hundred, uh, four five hundred thousand a million dollars but hopefully it does really good and I'll be shocked if it makes two hundred three hundred million at the box office if it does then it's a really good movie it got a good director but it could do it could do well at the box office now uh now I'm gonna open it up in the comment section down below and then and then I'll be done and then I'll give my final thought and I'll be done what do you think of the of the trailer do you like it I liked it. Uh, what are the reason if you're gonna go see the movie? What's the reason you're gonna see the movie? Um, do you think Pierre Bonten is the bad guy in the movie? And why did he not tell Jackie Chan in the movie uh, who the, who was the terrorist? And um, are you excited for this movie? Are you gonna go see it? Let me know in the comment down below. And the last question is, do you think the movie will flop or be the best at the box office? For me, I think it will be okay. It won't be a big success, it won't be a flop, it will be okay. But, I hope, and then, and then for me, the only reason I'm going to go see it, for Pim Bonson, I'm going to be Pim Bonson fan. He's one of my favorite actors, because I love him all the way back to GoldenEye. Okay? And... And I can't wait for him to make more and more movies years to come. I can't wait next year in 2018 to Mamma Mia 2. And I'm stupid pumped up. And, it, and hopefully there's not another Taken a trilogy movie where uh, uh, where we get two and three of the foreigners. No, no. The, leave it at, at, at uh, by itself and all that. Okay? And that's what I'm going to say. And so I'm, I will see it. And like I said, the only thing I'm going to see is because Pim Bond I love Pim Bond And be honest, like I said, if it didn't have Pim Bond I would not be reviewing it or even talking about it or even care about even looking forward to it and to end of that movie or what the movie is. I'm going to be a big Pim Bond fan. So I do like Jackie Chan in Rush Hour. He was good in Rush Hour. So the final thought. And hope the movie does good. Don't flop. Hope Jackie Chan does good in the movie. Pim Bonson does good in the movie. Hope he doesn't make them good money at the box office. Hope Pim Bonson make them keep making more movie. Uh, hope the movie the dead. Hope do not do not do not have it a trilogy, and do not be like another a taken franchise. The leave the movie by itself. One movie that's it. Hey. And thank you.